two, one. Um, yeah, so I was even just like hesitant to even do this part of it um, until, I mean, you kind of mentioned like what would you tell you before coming to this, um, like present me to pass me about this. Um, and uh, that kind of pushed me a little bit to, to speak to anybody who was in, in my position before even coming here, where um, <clears throat> I did have like some apprehension about coming uh, that related a lot to, you know, like the anxiety of, of um, not only like taking time out of like, like my week or, or work, but also, um, you know, kind of like that, is it, is it gonna be worth my time? Um, and uh, coming here, going through um, the week, um, meeting a lot of uh, different people from different backgrounds, different experiences, even though they weren't necessarily exactly like mine, um, really, uh, made the experience something that I was able to kind of feel comfortable in um, uh, and be more open to even just what the program uh, provided. Um, I've been to like other programs as well where, uh, <clears throat> you know, the, the intent was there to kind of help provide and uh, give uh, kind of like these tools, these uh, exposure to different types of therapy, uh, but what was different about this was that uh, specifically like the ART part of it, um, where there was actually counselors on um, on the premises to kind of like help us not only uh, introduce us to other therapies, but also work through certain things and in a safe environment uh, with other people that you know, not necessarily having to explicitly talk about things. Um, and I found that that was uh, incredibly helpful even now. Uh, it was a little bit exhausting, uh, especially going through the ART and just like needing um, to kind of like recover from that, but it, it helped. Um, I would think about, um, uh, just how that had uh, helped me get through even like this program, but how that could potentially help me later on. Um, and to myself, talk, speaking to myself in the in the past about this program, I would, I would, I would even kind of say like something along the lines of growth is always on the other side of discomfort. So even though I was anxious or, or uncomfortable or had doubts about whether it would be helpful, um, taking that kind of like leap of faith almost uh, to kind of go it, move into that, that discomfort to potentially find growth. Um, uh, and on this other side of that, I found um, other people that I could uh, open up to, talk to, be exposed to even their experiences and support and their resources that they had um, was incredibly helpful. Uh, where to the person that I want to be in the future <clears throat> um, and looking for who I want to be and, and, and the life that I want to live, um, the things that I feel that were kind of uh, part of this program, you know, the yoga was like uh, incredibly helpful, um, not only from a meditative and, 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 and like mindful movement perspective, it also kind of uh, allowed for, for throughout the different days of, of, of the program, um, some structure that allowed for some kind of physical movement, some exercise, even though it's like like, like slow, controlled movements, it, 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 it helped um, 
kind of relieve some of some of the like the 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 stress like without necessarily being high impact you know that uh, it challenged me in a different way um, <clears throat> there there are things from like just being exposed to and understanding art uh, the uh, accelerated resolution therapy art treatment um, <clears throat> knowing that that exists and uh, that it's available, I now have something that I can take with me um, outside of this and then look for in my area to, to as a way to help manage uh, certain emotions, certain process, process specific things that kind of like come up. Um, and even though like it didn't fix, like this short period of time didn't necessarily um, resolve or, or fix like the things that all the things that I'm looking for I know that I'm aware of, of other resources and other things that will help me along my way to on my journey um, to uh, living, living a more fulfilling life where um, even just kind of like I mentioned earlier like even if I didn't necessarily um, feel I, even if I had doubt at the beginning, um, it, it did require uh, a little bit of like courage and, and, and belief in myself that, you know, at the very least uh, I'm taking, you know, this risk uh, and pushing myself a little bit out of my comfort zone to find and to pursue that, that, that growth that, um, you know, the having courage does not necessarily mean that you're not gonna be scared, you're not gonna be anxious. It's, it's having courage, is having that and actually pushing past um, that fear, that anxiety, any, any doubt, uh, and moving forward towards like progress uh, where I feel like uh, that's kind of, that was kind of like the first step. Um, and then the reinforcement of that was coming through this program and, and meeting other people on the same journey um, and then coming back, coming out of it with um, having met some incredible people uh, with some amazing insights, different perspectives, uh, and, and resources are, like, all over the country where, you know, very, very welcoming, similar to, like, military, uh, uh, a military family outside of the military where, you know, if I'm in their town, there's, like, hey, hit me up, like, can help, you know, like, come over, visit, or there's some resources in my area that work incredibly well, uh, <clears throat> I'll help you. Um, so, and that's really uh, the biggest takeaway is, like, the people that you meet along the way on your journey and, and the support that people can give you um, to um, help you live a more fulfilling life, to help, help you um, <clears throat> make progress, um, live the life that you always kind of like wanted or, or felt you can, you could, um, could be. Um, but yeah, that, I think, I think as, as a whole, um, I enjoyed the program. And like I said, it was different from the four specifically because, uh, there was that that support that 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 the 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 therapies that existed during that um, actually were incredibly helpful. When you leave here and you go home, is there a family at home? Or? Yeah, I am. Um, I I I have. Um, it's, I don't have any kids. I don't have. Um, I'm not married. Um, I do have brothers and sisters, 10 nieces and nephews, so uh, a lot of uh, what I kind of feel and what I go through, like even coming back uh, from uh, deployments, um, I always kind of felt, even though I know and understand like our, our family as a unit and they want to be, they want to help me still kind of felt like I wasn't necessary, like they wouldn't understand, right? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, here I kind of felt that. And even 
even leaving the military, um, trying to find that in other places at work or like that same camaraderie, that same, that same, uh, understanding that same relatedness, um, where it's been challenging to even just like find outside of the military. Uh, and, and even though I kind of like work for like an incredible company that, that's really, um, <clears throat> uh, supports like mental health and wellness and really encourages us to kind of take wellness days and, uh, really takes care of us. Uh, it's, it's still, there's, there's just something there that, that they would never under necessarily understand. Uh, and, and even just being here and just the conversations that we've had throughout the, the conversation with um, uh, the other people here, it's, it, it was, it kind of was just comfortable to be able to speak to our, like my own experiences without necessarily people freaking out like, like, oh my God. Yeah. That ha and, then, and then their people's treatment of me change where I don't necessarily want um, people to be careful around me because like, oh, or treat me differently, right? It's, 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 it's uh, I don't know. It, it was just like refreshing to be in this environment and to be able to say the things and, ex and, and speak to things that I, that I actually never had been able to before. Um, not with my family, um, and <clears throat> and really like um, I've had therapists before, but like having it, I've been struggling to actually find a consistent therapist. So like the therapist I would have would leave, and so I'd have another. So it, it, it it's the consistency in therapy has been um, challenging for me to find, um, and I'm not saying that that's anybody like other people's experience, but like um, the goal is to kind of like find that. Mm -hmm that consistent um, uh, care and support and environment where I feel comfortable enough to even begin to go deep into some of those experiences that I, that I'm, I struggle with. Yeah. Well, hopefully, I mean, you know, you can come back. So you need a refresher or you just need to come up, come to Texas and hear the cows moving at night. <laughs> I live, I actually live I live in Houston so so okay. I'm not too far but um, but I I do have um uh I am getting like resources and, and connecting with other people and, and we are uh like the people here have been like a wealth of knowledge and, and exposing me to, even to things that I I didn't even know um I you know I was I sh I should actually like go to the VA, like, hey, this, is, this, is, this was supposed to happen, it didn't happen, so um, figuring out, like, well, you know, how, how can we help each other? Like, we know something, like, let's, let's help each other. Um, uh, and, 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 and just kind of support everybody on there. Everybody's journey is, is different, and support looks different for, for different people, so um, I think it's, it's been really, really helpful. Um, and even even if it's not right, like even outside of everything that's provided here, like you 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 could come. Everybody's journey is different. Everybody's needs are different. Even if you were, were to come out of here, not feeling like the things that were provided help were helpful, at the very least, you've met some incredible people um, uh, from like the people the people that 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 um, uh, came here for the same reason, or you know even. You know, people like Nikki, uh, Kim, like yoga was awesome. Um, you know, the, 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 the counselors that came down, uh, the conversations we had, uh, you know, at, at least you, a part of it was making a connection outside of, um, outside of like your normal day to day. And, and, and even like on, in some instances, um, you know, like you're kind of holding yourself accountable. Um, you have somebody to help you um, hold yourself accountable. Uh, so, so I think it, it, it was. Uh, um, it's a it's a good program, um, and, and at the very least, you know you 
you have support, you, you've met people, you've at least shared like a few days, uh, you understand some of their, their challenges, um, uh, which may or may not overlap with yours, but at least it's a safe space where, you know, no judgment, right? Um, uh, and the, I don't know if it was just specifically like these people, like the, the collection of people, but it just, it, it was just very, very comfortable, free flowing, and it just like, we kind of like clicked, I guess, in a way where, where, where we were able to each help create that environment um, and, and lift each other up, especially when, you know, some of the conversations would get deep. Um, uh, um, but yeah. Yeah. Hopefully it's helped you recognize some of the thresholds that you don't want to go down to the edge again. Yeah, well, it, 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 it has um, helped me um, look for even like be a little bit more mindful of like even when I'm beginning to start reaching that threshold so that I can you know do something do something to kind of like offset or even just like become more aware of it and 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 and, and before like my, my like a certain part of my brain kind of like takes over and allows you know my emotions to take over um take a step back and um and really kind of like think about like well this like i'm i, I feel like i'm getting upset about this let me let me let me pause and, and let me think about it before I'm not able to kind of rationally like think about something um, and, and take the proper actions for it and use um, certain techniques to kind of bring myself down um, or, or bring, bring that, that, that emotion down or like desensitize it in a, in a way to, to kind of step back and, and, and address it in, in that way. So um, <clears throat> something that, that I think even for myself, like being challenged with being pushed to a certain heightened level of like either anxiety or frustration. And at that point, like even past therapists be, um, bringing up, well, what do I do? What do I do when I'm already there? Mm -hmm. Right? Like, um, because a lot of what is, uh, taught and, and like a lot of the techniques are, are to kind of keep you from getting to that point. But when you're at that point, like how do you, how do you bring yourself down? Um, <clears throat> and while I might not necessarily be at the point where like if I do get there, I'm gonna immediately be able to, to bring myself down. At least I can start on that path of um, understanding and identifying where that threshold is and, and begin um, I don't know, like I, I don't know what 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 it's called, but like the bilateral stimulation of of um, of the ART. Yeah, um, and to kind of like know and be aware of like the specific the specific part of it where it is um, when you need to go through the ART with a counselor versus like the actual method to kind of. Um, like the bigger, the bigger things, you know, go to the professional. But if you're, if, if there are ways to kind of um, self-help. Yes. Did you get alpha stem or yeah. Those yeah. That, that that was also like uh, awesome too because it it also kind of like helps me understand and, and regulate, be more aware of my body and my breathing because like physical. There's a lot of physical, um, a lot of things that happen physically that you may not necessarily be aware of that once it gets to a certain point, it triggers something, right? So, so um, uh, controlled breathing, um, being aware of like your heartbeat, uh, and then again, like the combination of the alpha stem, yoga, a, a, all of, a lot of the things kind of overlap and made sense in, in, in how um, a lot of it is like knowing yourself, knowing, um, uh, ha being self-aware, uh, having um, having the tools to to um, kind of like leverage in terms of like breathing, controlling your breathing, 
um, <clears throat> being aware of of uh, uh, the 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 effects of of, of those um, is kind of like that first step to um, to like figuring out what to do next. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I know how to get off of this cliff. Yeah. Exactly. Um, anything that you'd want to say to donors? There are folks out there that they just want to know that what they put their money in is doing something. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's definitely um, incredibly grateful for the opportunity to have come here. And it, I don't know, I don't know what the whole like process is like, but like it, I, I do think it's helpful. I do think it will reach um, and help veterans um, in different ways. It might not necessarily be the same way that it, that it's helped me, and may not have have uh, the same experiences. But the the exposure to um, some of the pieces that are that are uh, in the program were incredibly helpful, um, and definitely I'm grateful for for the opportunity that. You know the donor donors and 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 what was given to make this possible uh, uh, for me to to not have to worry about um, uh, a lot of things during during this this uh, during this this uh, this program. Um, so I I would I would definitely recommend. I'm actually going to recommend this program to uh, a, a few friends of mine just because, like, I know that they are also kind of like struggling. Um, so it's not, it's not like the need isn't there, um, and that this wouldn't necessarily be helpful. I, I, I do think that, that this would be helpful for, for them as much as it, it, it has been for me, possibly even more. Um, they're a little bit better about, about certain things, but, uh, but, uh, uh, we're all kind of like looking for those opportunities to, uh, be able to connect, but also, uh, find things and resources that, are more helpful than um, the just giving us things, right? It, it, it's 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 like I, I get it that that people want to give like gifts or or you know oh you can do this this be exposed to this type of therapy, but like it's more about the consistency um, and things that will help us beyond this like one day or, or one session or, or one um, uh, uh, experience. experience yeah um, because like uh, I think I think like I just like really really appreciate it Women are so much more articulate. <laughs> um, the guys have been very helpful, but you know, once you get